The story of the football great Adrian Peterson using a wooden switch on his four-year-old son has people here in Fort Wayne talking, asking how much is too much punishment. News Channel 15's Megan Royce spoke with experts and parents today about where to draw the line. Megan? Well, you talk with parents in our area and you'll get a ton of different views on how much is too much. But after talking with our county prosecutor, the bottom line is parents should never use excessive force or objects to punish their kids. People feel like you know, physical punishment is illegal. Well, that's not necessarily true. From a legal standpoint, Allen County Prosecutor Karen Richard says there are a lot of things that go into drawing the line between punishment and abuse. Things like the age, physical and mental condition of the child, as well as what they did wrong. You don't you know, have to send the child to the hospital to get him to remember to brush his teeth in the morning. I mean, that would be an example of a punishment that was way outside the norm for trying to get them to remember to do something. In the case of Adrian Peterson using a switch to beat his four-year-old son, the prosecutor, along with parents I spoke with, say that was out of line. I, I agree with spanking, but there's a difference between spanking and beating. We asked those of you on Wayne.com, do you think it's appropriate to physically discipline children? The majority said yes. Only about 27 percent said no and others didn't care or had other feelings about it. Times are changing what, what may have been thought of as appropriate or normal in the past um, in regards to discipline may not be now. Brittany Burnt, an expert at a local nonprofit called SCAN, encourages parents not to use physical discipline. Instead, she says they should talk with their child. Giving your child choices where you can set the limits with those choices um, and then the child also feels empowered. Um, you know, they get to choose, what, do I want this cereal or that cereal, instead of having a big, you know, tantrum in the store. Now, SCAN has programs for parents looking for support in disciplining their children, and we'll have information on how they can apply on Wayne.com. Thank you for that, Megan.